What is going on guys, BRZ22 and today I'm bringing you episode 7 of Main Man Squads. And let's get started with my goalkeeper is going to be Millets. This guy's 2 star weak foot, 1 star skills, 6 2 traditional, picked him up for 550 coins. He has great diving, great reflex, uh, overall he's a pretty good keeper. Moving on to my first center back, it's going to be Ho. This guy's a 4 star weak foot, 2 star skills, uh, player record low high, he's 6 1. I picked him up for 6600 coins, he's he's actually a great defender, uh, great pace, great defending and uh, his heading is actually really really good. And moving on to my other center back, it's going to be Schwab. This guy's a 4-star weak foot, 2-star skills, 6-1 player worker, medium, medium. Picked him up for 1,900 coins. His defending tactics are really good. I really do like that about him. And moving on to my last center back, it's going to be Bungert. This guy's a 3-star weak foot, 2-star skills, 6-2 player worker, medium, medium. I picked him up for 1,700 coins and uh, great pace, great defending, pretty good in the air, pretty good at clearing as well. Moving on to my center defensive mid, it's going to be Alexandre. This guy's player worker, low high, two star weak foot, two star skills. Picked him up for 400 coins, which you can't go nothing wrong with that. He has great defending tactics as a center defensive mid. And uh, overall, he's a pretty good center defensive mid. And moving on to my other center defensive mid, it's going to be Bayer. This guy's three star weak foot, three star skills, 5'9", player worker, medium, medium. Picked him up for 700 coins. All his stats are pretty good, except his shooting. His shooting is not the best, but uh, he's a solid, solid center defensive mid. And moving on to my left mid, my left mid is going to be Eswine. This guy's a 3 star weak foot, 3 star skills, player worker, medium low, 6 foot. And I picked him up for 15,500 coins. I personally thought um, he just wasn't there for me. Uh, I think he was much better in FIFA 13. He was really overpowered. But on this FIFA, the only thing is pretty good about him is his pace, his dribbling. His shot's not bad. Uh, I like finessing with him, but uh, he just wasn't there. Moving on to my right mid, my right mid is going to be Mourinho, 3 star weak foot, 3 star skills, he's 5-5. Uh, only good thing about this guy is his pace and his dribbling, he has really nice dribbling and I uh, picked him up for 500 coins. And moving on to my center attack in mid, it's going to be Martins, this guy is a freaking tank, uh, his long shots are really really good, 4 star weak foot, 3 star skills, he's 5-7, uh, great pace, great dribbling, uh, great passing as, as well and I picked him up for 1000 coins which is not bad at all. Moving on to my strikers. It's going to be international man of the match, Martinez. This guy's a four-star weak for four-star skills, and he is a hell of a player. A great pace, great dribbling, strong player, great shot, and his heading is really OP. Picked him up for 42,000 coins, which is not bad at all. Moving on to my last player, and it's probably the best player on this team. He is Montero. Uh, this guy is a four-star weak for four-star skills. He is a freaking hell of a player. I was really impressed by him, and only for 500 coins, that is really cheap. Uh, he has great pace, great shot, really good shot actually, and uh, great dribbling. I really do like his skills. He's really smooth on this on the ball, and uh, overall, this team performed pretty good. I do like him. I give him an eight out of ten, um, or maybe even a nine, nine out of ten, because uh, they were actually a solid team. And uh, if we can get eight likes on this video, guys, that'll be awesome. Thank you for the support. And if you guys want to check out my Twitter, the link will be in the description below.